channel show here again and today we're going to be doing yet another wig review but before we get started make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and if you're new to my channel welcome so today we're going to be doing yet another review and this review is brought to you by love me hair so i'm going to be reviewing this unit that i'm actually wearing on my head right now and we're going to be doing a reverse review now i'm not even going to hold you guys i was a little bit um nervous but excited at the same time to review this wig because this is actually my first headband wig that i'm going to be reviewing with you guys hopefully not my last because this is a huge trend right now so this is my introduction to this so love me here was kind enough to send me one of their new headband wigs and they also come with these real cute headbands so when you order them you also get some headbands extra but you could put on whichever ones you want if you have any at home girl but they did give me two really cute ones they gave me this tie-dye one and then they gave me this one and i mean i can always appreciate that love me hair is always showing love because they always give you like these little extra gifts in your box and it comes in such a beautiful purple luxurious box so in your box you're gonna get um your little pouch and in that pouch you always get bobby pins um you get a tweezer which i mean for this wig we're not really going to use a tweezer but you always get a tweezer um you get the pouch that the hair comes in of course you also get a comb but i don't know where the comb went and you also get two wig caps so it's always really cute that they have that detail and because this is a headband wig you get two headbands and as you guys can see it's really easy to take off but i decided to do a review for you guys because i wanted you guys to see like the wig and stuff and i'm actually going to insert a clip of that live in here so you guys can see the the actual texture of the wig when i first got it before i actually brushed it out Ooh, uh inches i'm not really sure if you can but if you if you can that would be awesome because um especially with these you may want a little bit more room let me trying to adjust this so this is 20 inches of hair so this one values to 189 dollars um but of course you guys know depending on different lengths different prices so this is it right here let me actually move a little bit back so you guys can see give you a 360 so you guys can see let's look at the back we're gonna look at the back we're gonna look at the back um I definitely want to fix this part right there. There we go. So you want to make sure that the Velcro is not like poking out from the back. Make sure that you actually put it on so it's not poking from the back. So let me turn around for you guys. So this is the back. This is the back right here. And of course it is, the, the hair is going to be 20 inches, but it doesn't look like 20 inches right now because the curls are so defined. So it's not really going to look like 20 inches. But when I first got it, the curls were a lot tighter. So this is their deep wave wig. Um, and this is 20 inches of hair. And you get 250 grams of hair. So it's pretty, pretty dense. Really, really nice and dense. Um, this has four combs. So the cap, you're going to get one comb right here in the front. You're going to get one on your left side, one on your right side and one in the back of your head now this is the band that it comes with it comes with a black band attached to it so you cannot take this band off the whole purpose of it is that it's a headband so say if you don't have a headband with you or you just don't want to wear the other colored headbands you can just simply wear the black one so this is a put on and go wig the upside of it because it has a headband this is great for the winter time because it gets windy outside and sis i don't know about you but my ears get cold so you know this kind of covers that um i love the texture of this hair you guys it's so soft and it looks like my hair when i take it out of my braids like it's so gorgeous the shine the body like there is a little bit of frizz to it but you can put some deep conditioner, like a spray deep conditioner, not spray deep conditioner, um, a leave-in conditioner that's a spray, and you'll be fine. Like, it'll tame the frizz, or maybe some frizz control spray can definitely work for it, but I wouldn't put too much product on this, because this hair is just 
super gorgeous you can color it you can definitely color this hair however here's the trick this headband is black so if you want to wear this headband again i would not recommend bleaching this hair because you're gonna get some bleach on there unless you do an ombre which that would be cute you can do you can definitely do ombre but sis Make sure that you take care of this band because you don't want bleach marks on this. So that's kind of tricky. So let's go ahead and throw this bad boy on so you guys can see. So you do get some Velcro right here. This is a 22 inch circumference um, cap. So it's a medium size. I'm not really sure if they have like other sizes. I really hope they do because this is a little snug. And I am small headed, but you guys can see a little bit of the lump of the braids right there. But I am small headed. So um, it was pretty snug. So always make sure you secure the combs, especially with a wig like this, because this isn't like something that you're gonna glue on or anything like that. Um, people were asking me if you can sew this on. I can see that happening. Honestly, I, I think that it's possible, but I've never sewed on a wig to my head. So I don't really know how that works. This is if I don't push it back, which I like some forehead because I like it to look more natural. So I definitely love some forehead. I was saying, I was telling the people in the comments that this wig is definitely great for the gym. I wouldn't do nothing too crazy. I wouldn't be doing like crazy ass jumping jacks and stuff because you don't want the wig to fly off. But if you secure it, sis, if you take maybe like a scarf that you could tie right here that has like the little cute design and that's what you're into, um, you should be fine. Or maybe even if you tie the back like the instead of strapping it on if you tie it it'll be a little bit tighter let me actually give you guys a 360 so this is this side right here this is the back and let's get into this fullness you guys because this fullness is so 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 good so this is the back um this is the side right here and i'm going to be putting my discount code as well so you guys can take advantage of that make sure that you take advantage of my discount code and this is the front it's so so nice now let me show you guys my favorite part of these wigs and i'm gonna put on the other headband so you can see them but you could do versatile hairstyles as well which is nice because the headband wig the headband wig can get boring sometimes right so we could do different hairstyles and nobody will know that it's a wig because you don't got to worry about the hairline you don't got to worry about lace lifting you know, the best part is is that this is so full that you don't have to worry about webs showing in the back um they do have different textures if you're wondering like they have straight textures and stuff for these headband wigs but I prefer the curly because I feel like the curly looks the natural, the most natural for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and grab one of the headbands. I'm going to grab the tie-dye one. And this is like a double stacked, sort of say, um, headband. It's like a crisscross type of headband. So let's see. Let's get this. Let me get my life real quick. I don't really wear headbands, y'all, so. I would push this back, um, kind of give it like a Janet Jackson type of vibe, and then grab some gel, or you could grab your favorite um, edge control. I'd rather use edge control, but I can't find my edge control right now, so we're just gonna use a little bit of gel. Um, and take those baby hairs out, sis, because, you know, we definitely doing some Janet Jackson vibes. Some 90s cute vibes. You know, something cute, something a little bit different. And you know, this is great for those people who definitely don't want to do like, you don't want to waste your time trying to learn how to do a frontal. You could just put the headband on because nobody will know, sis. Like, I mean, you don't gotta like show your, your baby hairs either, but I just feel like the baby hairs adds something like really, really cute to it. So. I would do baby hairs. I don't know about you, but I like the baby hairs. 
Um, we're gonna wet this hair up a little bit too. I'm gonna spritz some water on it so you guys can see. It does dry pretty quick, the hair. So that's a good thing because like if you're deep conditioning it and you're going through the wash routine with it, you don't have to really worry about it taking too long to um, dry, but it dries very gorgeous. Like I've had um, deep wave texture wigs from Love Me Hair and they're so, so, so good. Let me show you guys the back. So you guys see no webs, no webs showing no web sis now i'm gonna show you um updos so i'm gonna do a pineapple ponytail and i'm also gonna do a nice little messy bun so i'm gonna take this down we're gonna put this one on i think this one looks nicer with my outfit because my outfit is kind of my outfit's all black so it goes a little bit better and it has navy blue that's not black on it's navy blue but you guys can't tell unless i just told you Okay, so I'm gonna crisscross it like this, and then I'm gonna take my hair, and where is my little hair tie? And being because it is a headband, headband wig, um, you could cover easily the back. A lot of times with wigs, when you do updos, it just looks so, so like wiggy. But as you guys can see, even from the sides, because that's like how you can tell, it's not like bumpy or anything. So it's super duper cute. It reminds me of me when I do my own, um, when I do my own pineapples with my own natural hair. So it looks like my natural hair. Like it just looks so beautiful. Um, messy bun. So definitely you wanna pick up the hair really well up here because you don't want it to sit. So you're gonna have a small bump, but it's, you don't, you just don't want it to be like super bumpy. Let me see if you guys, can you guys see me? Can you guys like really see it? Cause I feel like I can't see it too, too well. But I'm gonna take the baby hairs out. I'm gonna bring these little baby hairs out. And then bring a little bit of sideburns out. Like, don't be afraid, sis. Bring some sideburns out. Just a little tiny bit. And boom, super super cute like a little cute updo and stuff and just make sure that you're covering everything you could even cover your i feel like the covering the ears is kind of cute sometimes you know small little details make sure that you're covering the velcro from the black headband but yeah this look at this so easy like so so easy and it's just so effortless it's very very versatile like i said so like it's just so 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 easy i am very very impressed i'm very happy um love me hair shout out to y'all because y'all definitely did the thing with this wig let me know what you guys think in the comments below make sure that you guys follow me on instagram at pirata knows best and make sure that you do check out love me hair on their website they do have other beautiful styles for the for these head bit headband wigs they do have some other beautiful styles and also just other overall wigs like i'm pretty sure you guys have seen my other tutorials i absolutely love 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 me here so shout out to them and um yeah if you haven't done so sis subscribe to my channel because you're missing out and i got some fire fire content coming next month so make sure that you do subscribe and if you enjoyed this video, of course, give it a thumbs up and drop some love in the comments. I will see you guys soon. Bye.